Hello Internet, I'm Color40, and welcome to what might be the last episode of Mighty No. 9 Blind, because, well, we're on the Battle Coliseum, and the plot's at the point where I, we know who the main bad guy is, and uh, this, so this might be the final level. We're, yeah, well, I guess we'll just have to see about that. I'm guessing I'll be playing as Beck, and hey, fingers crossed that I won't have a game over this episode. Eh, well, let's be honest, I'm probably going to have a game over this episode, though. Ooh. Look at what happened to the Battle Coliseum. What in the blue blazes? The, the, the Battle Coliseum itself has been absorbed! How is that even possible? Infinity has gone beyond her original design and is assimilating everything around her. Avi, what are the conditions like surrounding the Coliseum? I gotta be honest with you, boss. It's one big old mess out here. The streets are packed solid with haywire robots! Hey boy. Understood. Return to the lab for now. What'll we do, Will? What'll we do? We'll stop panicking. Mm. Our only hope is to sneak in from above. Avi could drop back into the target zone. I like how Avi's becoming a big character right. now. Let's do this. You want to send back into that alone? Any other robot would be assimilated by Trinity almost immediately. Can't we make like a Beck clone of Beck? Ability. He's the only one that can do this. No pressure there, Beck. Beck, you and Trinity possess the same power. She simply does not understand how to wield it. You must teach her how to control it. Control, control, you must yes, learn sir. control. I'll do it. I'll save Trinity. I know you will, Beck. I know you will. Help us, Beck. You're our only hope. And the Star Wars references just keep piling on. Alright. How much instant death will be on this final level? Let's hope none. Thanks, Avi. <laughs> You're a real pal, man. Ready? Go. Systems are ready. Attention! Beck has landed in the Coliseum. Multiple incoming enemy signatures detected. Sorry, Tex Beck. This is the only gap I can find in their air defenses. I better scoot before Trinity nabs me. Good luck! Don't come in here, dude. You'll be assimilated too, and I don't want to have to fight you again. You're like my best friend now. Thank you for saying I'm good over and over again. Here we go. 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 Ow. I don't like these huge ones. Here we go. So can I move forward now? Oh, of course not. It on. Seriously, you should there. Thank you. This is an interesting level. Is Trinity creating a path for me? She may roll out the red carpet, but I wouldn't expect a warm welcome. There's no other way in. Follow that path for now, Beck. Maybe it will lead to Trinity's core. Beck, here we go. I am low on HP. Detected ahead. Be wary of reforming cell blocks. Even if you destroy them, they'll use the cells around them to reconstitute. Attack strategically. Woo, okay. I see how this is. Bring it on. Okay, this is a cool level. I like it. Aw, oh, man. I should have grabbed onto that. But thus far, I'm really liking this level. A lot of It's like a challenging level, but it's not like bad challenging like pretty much every other level. It's just like, it's a good challenge, you know? 
I also am not using any of the reselections, which is probably a bad idea. Alright, interesting. Oh man, come on! Die already! Thank you! No! What the heck? I am so sick and tired of me falling off just because of the stupid sliding mechanics. Like, I landed on the ground perfectly and then it's just like, oh, whoa, 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 apparently you're on an ice rink and you're going to fall off a cliff. It's so stupid. No strange robot voice that is not good. No, not happening again. Bring it on. Did you just die? Seriously, why there? Good grief. I still don't really know how those things work. Oh boy. This is gonna be fun. I'm always afraid those things are gonna crush me. Yeah, I still have no idea how these things work. Ooh. Need that. Like, I do legitimately need that. <laughs> Thank you for respawning there. Once again, I am not really sure what I'm supposed to do. There we go. Thank you, man. I love you. So many cells. The entire place is made out of them. How many robots did Trinity absorb? Too many. Trinity was programmed with a single prime directive to grow, to evolve. Why would you make this? Yeah, that's me. That's me. Beck is pretty awesome. Woo. So Beck was really made just to counter Trinity. So I was literally made for this moment. Oh shoot! Should have gone through there. The path. It's gone. 
Trinity is getting serious about absorbing Beck. A, a fall here would mean instant assimilation. Wait, wait, what the heck? Well, how am I supposed to get through that? There was literally, like, no way I could have gotten through that. Alright, here. Gotta try something. This, uh, the path! It's gone! Nope! There's just, like, no way through that. Well, I'm not retiring. Nope. <laughs> I'm too young to retire. I'm only 20. Still feels weird to be able to say that. In my mind, I think I'm still like 15 or 16, but... Hmm. Come on, skip cutscene! Alright. So this level is basically just a giant Zerg rush. This is the only gap I can find in their air defenses. I better scoot before Trinity nabs me. Good luck! Fight the good way! Why wouldn't it shoot through that guy? Sometimes your buster shots shoot through enemies and sometimes it doesn't. Just make it consistent, please. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, here. Come on, Giga Cube. Bring it on. That's more like it. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Open the doors. Is Trinity creating a path for me? Hmm. Well, she may have the red carpet, but I wouldn't expect a warm welcome. There's no other way in. Follow that path for now, Beck. Maybe it will lead to Trinity's core. Maybe. That's one. Why would you make something this dangerous, dude? Even if you destroy them, you'll use the cells around them to reconstitute. Attack strategically. Bring it on. <sighs> All right. We're doing well this far. Thank you. Do you think you could do me a big favor and just die? Seriously, I don't know why sometimes they respawn and sometimes they don't. <laughs> like I said, always afraid that they're going to kill me. No, can't die here, can't die here. Why do they sometimes respawn? This is getting ridiculous. Can you please tell me why sometimes they respawn? See, that one didn't respawn. That one didn't respawn. That one didn't respawn. But that one does.
And that time it didn't. I literally just can't make rhyme or reason of it. So many cells! The entire place is made out of them! How many robots did Trinity absorb? Trinity was programmed with a single prime directive to grow, to evolve. She will pursue any course that allows her to assimilate more cells in perpetuity. I realized later the dangers inherent in such a system, which is why I refined the design. You mean with your next model? With Beck? That's like I've said before, this game is way too much talking. Like, the game does not need this much talking. Let me dive, let me dive, let me dive under. Alright. The path! It's gone! Trinity is getting serious about absorbing back. A fall here would mean instant assimilation. Oh, that's right. I can. It's an updraft, so I can just rocket boost in from here. I don't like this though. <laughs> Some places there are updrafts, other places there are not. And of course you've got annoying enemies like this everywhere. And of course they're just getting reabsorbed without telling me why! With all of this freaking dialogue, they couldn't at least explain why this happens? They're just like, some of them do this. So, gee, thanks. Could you tell me why, though? Oh, are you kidding me? This is turning into Windy Well from Donkey Kong Country 2, and not in a good way. Halfway point with yay health, hey, yay health. Here we go. Here we go. Ow. Here we go. Darn it. Thank you, sir. You are a gentleman and a scholar. Is this the core? That looks like the core. Are you? Yep. Pretty? So, it's finally come. Doctor White playing this the whole time. He just wanted to see something really creations. cool happen. Squaring off. Back. Stop her the way you did the other mighty numbers. Save. Yeah. Yes, sir, Professor. Whoa, it's Trinity! The what? That doesn't even make any sense at all! You can't have infinity! Why, that can't even exist in this world. Oh, hey, this is already kind of like the Donkey Kong Country 2 final boss. Okay, or more like the Yellow Devil. Jeez. Uh, well, I'm gonna try to find Trinity's weakness, then. <laughs> I've only got three more lives to figure it out. If I can't on the last life, I honestly might just look it up. Because I really don't want to have to go through all of that again. Thank you for... This guy just keeps giving me lives, and I love it. Hey, you like propellers? Go! Go! Uh, don't seem impressed by that. Ow. <laughs> 
This is going to be an interesting boss, to be sure. Well, okay, well, how in the world are you even supposed to get through that? Oh, that did a colossal load of nothing. And, yeah, okay. Ow. I like the sound effects this character makes. You don't seem impressed by that either. <laughs> this is making me uneasy. Ooh, you do not like ice all that much. <laughs> Alright, well at least I've got my weapon. Trinity does not like ice. What's it with, like, robots just do not like ice? Is it because, like, I freeze their circuits or something? Computer freeze or something? Oh. Uh, that, that's pretty funny if it's like, oh, ice is good against everything, because, you know, computers tend to freeze. <laughs> that would actually be kind of funny. Not very intuitive, but it would be funny. Alright, no li extra life this time. That's alright. I like you anyways, little robot. You're so cute. Don't mind me. Just have a giant blimp on my back. They're standard issue. Yeah, I've already taken out a huge chunk. There's this is no, there's no way this is the whole battle though. There's definitely gonna be another form. Oh no. Woo! Ice even just continuously damages her, which is nice. Alright. This is new. Oh, interesting. I already see where this is going. Didn't see where that was going, though. Darn it! I was sure she was going to start glowing. Alright. I think I've got her bit, like pattern down, though. I guarantee this is not the only form, but... I kind of hope it is. This is okay. So this is basically like the uh, devil fights from the Mega Man series, where it's like super intimidating at first, but very definitive pattern, and once you figure it out, it's actually pretty easy. I like that. I like how they're staying to the Mega Man roots. Got an extra life? Nah. All right. I am super powerful. I'm actually just going to try my buster against this first time. Nope. Forget that. Ho oh! I don't care what galaxy you're from, that is awesome. Oh, all right, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm getting the hang of it. Yeah, I don't know why, but I really like the sound effects Trinity is making.
I just hope there's a checkpoint between her two forms. Yeah! First form down. But like I said, there's got to be more to that. Yep, definitely more. <laughs> and something tells me... Thanks, Monotone. Just as Beck absorbed aspects of the other mighty numbers, she's learning from Beck. She's struggling with what she's done, what she'll do next, how to control her power. You can do it, Trinity. Open your mind. Show the world that robots can evolve. Are you on her side, dude? Come on! <laughs> You're supposed to be rooting for Beck. It's mighty number nine, not mighty number zero. Alright. Well, that's gonna do a fat lot of nothing. Oh, interesting. Some do like it hot, so... Whoa. Okay. Burn! Burn! <laughs> that was so worth it. This is not worth it! Darn it! I bet I have to do her first form again as well. Darn it! I don't want to have to go through the stage again. P please and thank you. Alright, Artie, you can do this. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Here we go. Thanks for the extra life, I love you. In a platonic way. Darn it. Not doing well against the first form. Darn it! She is owning me! Really owning me. Super owning me, as in, like, she killed me. <laughs> Probably because I was dashing into her so many times. Darn it! I don't even know, like, her weakness for her second form, if she even has one. I know it's not ice. It might be fire. I hope it's not fire, because fire is such a pain in the neck to use. But it seemed like the Buster was just doing a good job against her, so. Yeah. Another life, please. Thank you! Alright, Trinity. Oh my gosh, Trinity looks like Volt from Tales of Symphonia. That's who it was. Darn it! How most other bosses are like once you like do the dash attack when they're weak to it, you can just pass through them without taking damage. But not apparently the case for this one. Darn it! Oh, oh 
man. Oh, now she's doing this move. Great. Darn it! Oh! Another life, please? I can't even get to her second form anymore! Her first form isn't even all that hard. Skipping it. I guess I'm just bad. Here we bring it on. Darn it. I was counting on you to give me an extra life that I don't deserve. Hard to dodge that second wave. Darn it. Ow! Yeah, like I should have just not taken damage there because I was dashing into her at the time. Alright, first form down. I, f I should get full HP at the end of this. I'm not sure if I do, but I should. Uh, can I skip this, please? Darn it! No, I don't. And okay, great, fine. No, there's no need to even try to be courteous there. Darn it. I really, really, really do not want to have to do the stage over again, so... I really do want to figure out her weakness for her second form. Bring it on. All right, all right. Apparently, Trinity's second form is weak against bombs. My favorite weapon. Ooh, all right. I'm getting a bit better at dodging that. Thank you! I, that really means a lot to me. And again, should not have taken damage there. Darn it! This is my last life. Come on, cut me some slack. Darn it! Yeah, all right. I'm not optimistic about this, though, because I have very little HP, and I've barely even seen the second form.
Darn it! Well, this is off to a terrible start. And again, should not have taken damage there! You can- every other enemy in the game, you can boost through it when they're flashing and you won't take damage. Why is it this one is different? <sighs> no way, or one of them assimilate you. What the heck? I shot two bombs at that! What else do you want of me? Okay, well that's just not it. And neither is that, there's literally no way to dodge that. Oh, you go under it. Yeah, that part's really annoying. <laughs> and of course, new moves doesn't help. Oh, ah! I'm still alive? Okay. Alright, okay, now that's just unfair, because there's practically no time to be able to jump through that. And you don't get any warning when that's gonna happen. And the platforms are moving, so wow! This is just ridiculous now. Oh my gosh, the second form is just not fair. I hadn't even gotten to the especially not fair part. But it's like, oh, do you want to dash into it to like actually damage it? Well, you're going to take damage too. No way around it. I haven't been this mad during a Let's Play since Bear Swarming. What the heck? Once again, got him down to zero HP and dashed into him, and yet I die! And again! Sometimes you can dash through them, sometimes you can't, and there's really no way to tell if you can, because they barely change color at all. Could you at least have like made them turn red or blue? Anything but purple, since it already is purple? That's a really bad design. <sighs> well, I don't know why it didn't work that time. <sighs> yeah, for some reason you just cannot dash through that without taking damage. Really, really, really bad design. Because that's literally the only enemy in the entire game that works like that. <sighs> this point, I I'm just gonna shut up and concentrate. Here we go.
Tu en una. Alright, so far so good. Try to dodge this uh, lag laser. <sighs> you have to jump at like literally the last possible second. Please don't shoot the lasers at me, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Also, the farther this boss fight goes along, the laggier it gets. What the heck? Yeah, once again, it should be dead. The end of the game, please. Ooh, it's a ruby. Oh no, it's not. Ooh, it's a ballerina. Mission player. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I don't even care what score I got. See, should have gotten an S. You should just automatically get an S for going through that hell. It's like it's creepy female proto man. Your true form. I did it. I mean, you did it. She Trinity. did we nothing did but get in my way. Excellent work, Beck. Excellent. You have surpassed even my greatest expectations. Well, now I know I died twice, even though she should have been dead. It's because she had an extra form when she had zero HP. Sound only. Oh my gosh. If this game has like hour long credits, that's gonna be the worst. Because this video is already at pretty much the two hour mark. I've been sitting here playing this level for two hours straight. My sanity's kind of shot right now. Aww. aww. That does not make up for the hell that I had to go through though. Not at all. So now we get some like comic book style images. All right. Yes! End of the game! At last! Well, I really don't want to talk all that much because my voice is kind of shot. 
And I am just like, you have no idea how much torture I went through on that stage. Holy cow. Well, alright, so I started out with this game hoping it would be really cool. Did not turn out how I expected. It's still like, I guess it's, it, some parts of it were fun and it's like, it's good, but it had a lot of really big problems. Biggest one is probably, what the, mighty number? Uh, let's look up mighty, mighty number 10,000. Alright, fine. Whatever. I don't even know what that's up there. This game just had a lot of big problems. Mainly game lag, instant death, and the fact that it, the game just punishes you so much if you don't know what to do. Like, even for like that last fight, for example, I knew exactly what I had to do to beat her, and yet it still took me two freaking hours. Just That's just unacceptable. There were so many parts of this game where we're like, this could have been awesome, but it wasn't. And I'd say, if they make Mighty Number no. 9-2, make some huge changes. One, get rid of pretty much all the dialogue. Not necessary. Make it much more like the 8-bit Mega Man. It's like, even make it 8-bit. Put in good music. Get rid of so much instant death. Make it, maybe remove lives altogether. Make it kind of like Rayman Origins or like Rayman Legends. Where it's like, lives are moot. And it's like, those are some of the most fun platformers that are like, in existence. That would be nice. But, yeah, if you do that, the next, the sequel will be, like, infinitely superior to this one. Wow. I kind of, like, I kind of regret having to say all this negative stuff about the game, because I know the people put in... Oh, skip to the next part. Skip. Skip all. As hard as you guys worked on the game, I really don't want to have to see all of that. Trinity was brought under control when she absorbed Beck's empathy and caring nature, his heart. My new synthetic heart routine makes it possible for robots to evolve ethically, to grow responsibly. Just wait. This will revolutionize the science of robotics. The fate of all robots, of all mankind. <sighs> You got lucky, that's all. And cleaning up your own mess doesn't make you a visionary. Besides, who can guarantee the behavior of robots left to their own devices, evolving on their own? Hm. This heart of yours is unnecessary, and worse, dangerous. I remain unconvinced, Bill. Don't call me that. My name is William White. I'll show you. I'll show you and everyone else who doubted me. Yeah, interesting. Then only time will tell if this mighty number nine, this Beck, is a blessing or a curse. Ah, interesting. I will say, that was pretty interesting. That's really all I have to say, though. So maybe Dr. White is not as much of the good guys we fought. Boss Rush? Heck no. Never doing that. I am so done with this game. Wow. I'm Color Flarty. Thanks for watching. Wow. I, I don't know how long this video is going to be, but I'm just going to say we like are about to hit the two hour mark. And I'm guessing you didn't watch all two hours of it because if so, wow. I am so, so sorry. Anyways, I will see you for my next Let's Play, and it will be better than this one. Have a great day, and God bless.